this portrait of William Shakespeare hovers near the edge of space, marking 400 years since the first volume of the iconic playwright's works was published. The image of Shakespeare atop the world, I mean, come on, that's, that is a literal metaphor, right? For, um, you know, Shakespeare being the world's dramatist. Filmmaker Jack Jewers sent the image, as well as a speech from A Midsummer Night's Dream, up in a weather balloon for a film series paying tribute to the anniversary. His six short films explore contemporary issues such as refugees at sea or the war in Ukraine, combined with Shakespearean speeches and poems. People all too often can kind of uh, get too intimidated by his language, but actually, once you get past that, um, the themes that he is exploring in his drama um, are every bit as kind of gripping and relevant to our everyday lives as something we watch on TV today. That first volume of plays is known as Shakespeare's First Folio. It's considered one of the most important books in English literature. Without it, plays, including Macbeth, might have been lost. Shakespeare's friends compiled the folio seven years after his death, publishing it on November 8, 1623. It's believed some 750 copies were printed, containing three dozen plays. Will Tosh is the head of research at Shakespeare's Globe Theatre in London. Shakespeare's colleagues, his fellow actors, theatre owner, theatre company owners, decided to pull that material together and produce a kind of testament to their former colleague, to the greatest playwright that they had certainly ever worked with, and as it turned out, the greatest playwright in the English language. 